All right, day 94, 94 consecutive days of walking at least one mile. I'll put the camera on and we'll get going. I think Ranger wants some food first. Get him a little food. He had breakfast, but now he's probably ready for some lunch. It's cold today. All right. What are you doing, buddy? You want some food? You hungry this morning? All right, come on. Let's go. Come on, get some food, get some lunch. See if you're interested in doing a fist bump. You want to do a fist bump today? Oh, yeah. <laughs> try again. You want to try one more time? Do a little more effort this time. There you go. <laughs> you barely want to touch, huh? All right, buddy. Here you go. Come on. We got some lunch. You hungry? Oh, yeah. Ready for the food. Oh, I put my jacket on. I got to put the camera on first. All right. Ranger's always good for some levity. All right. Got the first couple of roses blooming in our yard. Take a look at those before we get going here. And put a jacket on. It's cool today. All right, got this red rose getting ready to blossom. Then we got like a pinky peach blossoming. Gonna have a whole bunch in the next couple weeks. All right, let's get going here. What is this? Some kind of metro thing or something. Little red rose out here. Starting to blossom. Whole bunch of white ones right here. You know, about 50 on that in another couple weeks. There's a whole bunch of stuff out here. What's going on? I don't know. All right, let me start the timer. We'll get going. See what we see today. Always something interesting. All right, here we go. Let's see, I wanna go down this route, I guess. Go see what we see today. Brisk. All right, put in your guesses how far I'll go, how long it'll take. Yes, wind is no fun. See what we're up to today. How many dogs will we see today? We'll put the over under dogs. At, uh, I'll say four and a half. Go through the neighborhood, we'll probably see a few delivery trucks. Uh, I'll say three and a half. Muscle cars, I'm not counting Teslas today. Muscle cars, uh, three and a half. Whew, this wind is no fun. Nice and sunny. The wind is not pleasant. Whew. Whew. All right. Let's see what we see today. I know. So there goes the first muscle car, blue Mustang 5.0 GT. Let's see if we can get across the street here. Got a few cars coming. Uh, 
guy's gonna run the light go after him all right let's see what we see down here today here comes the first dog can't tell what it is it looks like a pit bull I'm not really sure Whew. sunny today it's about 61 but the wind chill puts it back on a 55 really windy maybe 54 I'm building a house over there Two or three on a lot or something. I don't know. <sighs> Playing some kind of music. It, it was a pit bull. Didn't want to turn though. Whew, wind is unpleasant. Uh, it was that Sunday I went down to uh, Manhattan Beach. And that was pretty interesting. Saw a whole bunch of beautiful houses and saw the house where uh, Jared Goff lives. He's a quarterback for the Rams. Well, he was, now he's for Detroit. And uh, he found out that the house he lives in, Shaq used to live in it. So I don't think he bought it from Shaq, but it's the same house. I have it on camera, but I didn't know which one it was, so I was looking across the street for his house and it was behind me, but I did get it on camera. Probably go back there again sometime. What is this? It's a big old Jeep of some sort. Wrangler. It's a Hera. Nice looking Jeep. Big. Let's be powerful. Man, this wind today. Maybe it's down to 52 with the wind chill fact. It's super windy. It'd be nice to turn around. <laughs> Look at that license plate. Like teeth on it or something. Like saber tooth tiger teeth or something. Whew. All right. I don't know how long I'll go today against this wind. Turn around, the quicker the better. Whew. Man, like a windstorm or something. Well, if you're playing along, write down how many days in a row this is for you. And it's an El Camino, the 70s. Always around, I've seen it before. How many days in a row this is for you? How far you've walked? You've done 20 days in a row, 50 days in a row. This is day 90, let's see, one, two, 94 for me, going for 100. I think I'll make it. I mean, 100 days in a row. There's a couple muscle cars, Mustang. So that's a second, second Mustang of the day. And a, it's kind of losing its paint. What is this? A, uh, let's see. This will be a Challenger. Challenger has two doors. Matte green. Flat flat matte green it's like it's already seen it's better days kind of chipping away at the paint three muscle cars we might get the over on the muscle cars today Whew. can't wait to start walking back the other way a third of a mile in Whew. 
here's a Hummer, H2 Hummer. Don't see many of these anymore. I think I've seen two, maybe three on the walks. I don't think that's defined as a muscle car, all-terrain vehicle. They got popular, oh gosh, 30, 40 years ago, I guess, and Arnold Schwarzenegger used to drive a Hummer. Everybody would think it looked like a tank. He's driving it around on the L.A. streets. And people started buying them, but then they're getting six miles to a gallon. Didn't work out too well. All right, here's three more muscle cars. Two Mustangs and a... What is this? Two-door, so that's a Challenger. No? Yeah, Challenger. Charger has four. I never get hardly, I always have to think about that. It's a Dodge uh, Challenger, I believe. Jet black. Yep, Challenger says right there. I finally got it right. Two doors, a Challenger. Let's see, so that's uh, one, two, three, four. There's that was. Four or five, and that's the number. I don't know. It's another Dodge up here. Six. Whew. So this is a two-door. So this is a Challenger as well. It's another kind of. Is it black? Black or gray? The sunglasses taint the colors. Kind of a metallic gray black. What's that? Six, five, six, six muscle cars today. Wow. Already the over. I'm not counting Teslas. All right, this block I can make the turn. Thank goodness. Oh, here comes a car. Well, if you've been watching the channel and you hadn't started walking, write down your goal. You say in the comments section, people with written goals are 10 times more likely to achieve their goal than people that just think about it. So write it down. If you want to do a half a mile a day or half a mile every other day, it's not that, not that hard. Just get out and 10 minutes out, 10 minutes back. That's it. It's over. Everybody can do that just about. If you're walking inside on a treadmill, you can watch this video and it seems like you're walking outside. I always see something interesting on it. It's a first delivery truck. I always see something. Monday we saw that I mean Sunday saw the Manhattan Beach that super um, modern house and it was really kind of bizarre said that uh, the owner of Shorewood Realty owned the house again Shorewood Realty Let's see it's early Think of the word I'm trying to think of, sir. I can never think of that word. Pristine, not pristine, but uh, clinical. It's very... Modern looking. That was on uh, Sunday. And Monday we saw that brown tree with the red bows on it. The flowers that make it look like bows. See if a yellow lab is around today. But that's a really interesting tree. That was on uh, sun, uh, yesterday, Monday, I mean. Uh, tie my shoe. A very brown tree with no leaves and uh, flowers bloom on it. Blooms look like red bows. Uh oh, you're not out today. Must be in the house. 
See if the dogs are out over next door. I don't think so. No dogs today. Nope. Everybody's in. All right, I'm not walking up another block. I'm gonna walk this way and back. Uh, but yeah, that was uh, that was on Monday. There's a whole bunch of them down Marine. There's like 50 of them. And they all have a red bark, I mean brown, no leaves, but the, about this time of the year they bloom red, like red bows on them. But what it is, is uh, these pine cones, they're like pine cones, and the pine cones turn red and blossom out into these red, sort of like flowers. They look like bows. I, I had never seen one up close until Monday. So you see that, that was on Monday. That was really neat, two day, a video. Not yesterday, day before yesterday. Now these are kind of neat. Look at these flowers. It's pretty. And what they are. The hope, about a hundred of them getting ready to bloom. Having a lot of pretty flowers this year with all the rain it rained again this past weekend. Crazy. All the rain. We have more rain this year than far and away we normally have. We have a lot of nice flowers. Love. Let's see, head back up here. Now we're not walking against the wind anymore. It feels good. Ah, nice and warm. Uh-oh, looks like a moving truck up here. <clears throat> moving out to the country, I guess. I don't know where they're going. You can check out, but you can never leave. All right, feels good. It's so warm. Right. A yellow, a bright yellow. What is it, Honda? Yeah, I got a taxi cab. If I'd want to drive a bright yellow car, I saw a yellow Ferrari. I guess I'd drive that. I saw that about uh, so I haven't been over there in a minute. Uh, probably next week I'll go over to the Ferrari, the uh, exotic car shop garage where they work on all the Ferraris and Lamborghinis from they ship them from all over the world. I think I've been over there what two or three times on this channel. I have to go over there again maybe next week. But I saw a $16 million Ferrari there last time I was there. It's probably three weeks ago or something. I don't know if they're moving or what. Moving on up. Uh, it's like they're getting a maybe a washing machine or something. All right. Oops. couple little half a cars fiats it looks like a little <laughs> like a little hot wheels car with those wheels on it it's small goodness and they have a back seat who could fit back there it's like a clown car 
All right. Let me see one, one dog today. Two, one dog so far. Pit bull. Is that it? That's it. One dog. One mail truck. No Amazon today. Not yet. Five muscle cars. Yellow Lab was not out today. I don't know his name. Might be a girl. I don't know. Some car covered up with a... Let's see if we can figure it out by the wheel. Uh, nope. I don't know what it is. AMG, I guess a Mercedes of some sort. I guess. I don't know. Check out some of those uh, videos from Manhattan Beach. I've been down there three or four times now. Went, one time I went down there and saw that house, toured that house. It was twelve and a half million dollars. It was about a month ago. No, I don't think I put that. Yeah, that was uh, two or three, three or four weeks ago. That was really interesting. The beautiful views, the Pacific Ocean. You gotta see that one. Said one, there was a guy that lived there, he'd already moved out. One owner, the only owner. Didn't have a family or anything, he liked to entertain. I think he had six bedrooms or something. Had a beautiful view from the rooftop. It was unbelievable. You gotta see that, 12 and a half million dollars. And he'd already moved. Been gone for like a month. He had all marble floors in and they told him that it was too, uh, not welcoming, so he, they tore up all the marble and put in wood. The red Jeep. That must have cost him $100,000 to put wood floors throughout. He had marble in there. Can't imagine. He had money to burn. And then, uh, speaking of other houses, there's a house on the beach I've been by a couple times now, maybe just once. It's a man in Hermosa. And uh, it takes up three lots right on the strand. They said that was the last one. After that, they built a code. They made a code where they said you couldn't... Uh, oh, look at that red tree. It's kind of neat. You couldn't buy three on lots. Uh, somebody's there, so I'm not going to go up there. Uh, race car. Uh, three on a lot. I mean, not three on a lot. They bought three lots on the Strand. And they were trying to sell the house. I don't know where the owner moved to, but the, it looks like it could seat on the patio. It always looks like it could be a restaurant. It looks like it could seat 40 out on the patio. And it's... Uh, it was on the market for $150 million. And uh, they couldn't sell it. Shocker, I know. $150 million. It's got a pool on the second floor, if you can believe that. And at the bottom of the pool, there are highlight, uh, skylights that go to the first floor. <laughs> if it ever breaks, you're going to have a mess. But uh, a realtor told me on Sunday that they rented that house... $125,000 a month for a year, year's lease at $125,000 a month. So, I guess if they couldn't sell it, they make some money from it. $125,000 a month for a year. So that was, see that house was about a month ago. Well, you can only see the exterior. That was an open house. 
it was not an open house <laughs> not like the across the street here not like the 13 12 and a half million I toured you can walk through that house if you want to see the video that was a couple weeks three weeks ago maybe always something in Manhattan Beach so an orange Cadillac and oh I saw that uh, what was that one uh, Aston Martin I think it was a I don't know how much that car was 150,000 or something it was uh, made its debut in one of the James Bond movies so that was kind of cool I think it was 10 or 12 years old can't think of the name of the movie well only one delivery truck but it's one dog four I think five or six muscle cars today so I always see something another another mile in the books yeah go over to the car shop tomorrow I haven't been over there in a few weeks go walk that part of the neighborhood last time I was here I saw the 16 million dollar Ferrari I saw a uh, well this wasn't at the car shop here's a little dog Tesla truck that was interesting the guy said he just bought it and uh, went to the grocery store three or four people stopped him asked him about it it was interesting he showed me how the back opened you can check that out that was about it's the two three three weeks ago and I saw a 55 black Mustang <laughs> <laughs> the cute little guy. How old is he? Uh, six months. Six months. Uh oh, he's scared. Hey, buddy. Hello. He's scared. Hello. Yeah, she's, she's a little. A little skittish. Yeah. She looks like she wants to come over. She's just kind of scared. Yeah, she's just a little nervous. Hello, girl. It's okay, Bella. Bella, come here. Come here, Bella. Hello, Hello. girl. There you go. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> you came a back way, huh? You got to get what's comfortable for you. Cute. Oh my gosh. She just needed to be reassured that it was okay. Yeah. That's okay. Oh, you're a cute little girl. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. oh now you've warmed up, huh? Oh, how long you had her? Uh, we've had her almost uh, four months. Oh, four months. At, at eight weeks. So. Oh, you're such a cute little girl. Yeah. Cute. I uh. get her used to coming out here. Oh, Bella. You're going to make so many friends such a cutie everybody's gonna want to pet you oh no, she got a lot of energy huh it's good girl maybe i see you again huh all right have a good day <laughs> see you later i don't know how much you could see the coat was kind of blocking the camera a little bit cute little girl bella I haven't seen her before. Hopefully you can see a little bit of her. And there's another delivery truck, number two. One mail truck, one UPS. Uh-oh, yard guy's here. The bane of Ranger's existence. How you doing? Yeah. He hates the yard guy. Still working on the street here. They're putting in a new water pipe or something. Got a big mess. Blocking the flowers and everything. It's not pleasant. All right. Let's see where we're at here. Now we're gonna do. I'm gonna do a little bit more. I'm gonna do 1.3. So I got to go a little bit farther. The cute little puppy he looked looked like he's about two months old super little hope you see it a little bit on the camera here he came up between around between my legs from the backside he was real skittish he just wanted to be reassured that it was friendly 
so little fit in two hands all right if you guessed 1.31 in 27 minutes and 19 seconds you are the winner another successful day in the books oh boy cute little puppy hopefully you see that on camera he's so little cute Let's see what ranger's up to why are you doing little do you hiding from the yard guy i know you hate the yard guy he's not a friend of yours is he all right that's it for today another successful day in the books so you check out some of the other videos i'll put a suggestion that you'll probably like subscribe like come back tomorrow new video every day 10 a.m bye